Grok 3. Grok 3. Grok 3. This thing has taken over the market for the past two days. Let's test its power. I searched for it, and boom, other sites are already ranking at the top. Elon Musk should take notice of this. But hey, he's a busy man. He'll figure it out. Let's open Grok 3 through X. Until yesterday, it was running without requiring any sign up. No worries. We'll sign up and ask. Blink a tricolor LED using ESP32. And what do we get? 25 websites scanned in a flash. Now, if only I had turned off the search function, I could have really tested its raw power. But for those who don't know, I've already made videos on ChatGPT and DeepSeek. Go check them out. The analysis begins. A tricolor LED typically has three pins, red, green, and blue, plus a common pin, either anode or cathode. It neatly listed everything needed for the project. Great effort in explaining the RGB LED. Circuit setup looks solid. Now, let's check the code. GPIO pins are correctly defined. Setup function looks perfect. The blink logic in loop is spot on. This code is definitely going to work. Grok3 even explained additional details properly. Well done, Grok3. All right, time to build it. But wait, is this LED common anode or common cathode? Now just copy and paste the code into the Arduino IDE software, just like I'm doing. I connected the long leg to 3.3s first and then to GND. Boom! Got it right. Eureka! Grok3 is working brilliantly. So how about showing some love? Like and subscribe. But who am I kidding? You never do. Fine, at least watch the next video. I put in real effort, bro. Samja Kuro.